it's not just about mastering the technical aspects of the craft. You actually have to believe that you can do this. When anxiety creeps in, acknowledge it, but don't let it stop you. This is the Cardi method. Let's think about your mental frame and minding your mental frame. Start paying attention to how you frame situations in your mind. Are you focusing on what could go wrong or are you always looking for opportunities? When you catch yourself slipping into negative thinking, consciously flip the script to focus on the positive. Embrace challenges every single one of them as an opportunity. Every difficult shoot or tough client is an opportunity to learn and grow. Instead of dreading those opportunities or those situations, view them as chances to improve your skills and expand your creative boundaries. But we have to acknowledge and we have to acknowledge the anxiety that we feel. And believe me, anxiety is just a lack of preparation. So we have to acknowledge, but then move past anxiety. When anxiety creeps in, acknowledge it, but don't let it stop you. Instead, shift your focus to the excitement about what's possible, what the possibility of what's about to happen, and the excitement of what's possible when you succeed. Anxiety is just energy. That's it. Anxiety is just energy. Redirect it towards anticipation. Visualize success consistently and make it a habit to visualize your successful shoots and projects. Imagine the praise and the satisfaction that comes with nailing an incredible photo. That positive imagery keeps your mind focused on what's possible rather than what could go wrong because what you focus on happens. So you have to reflect on just how you're framing your thinking and adjust regularly. Take time, take time weekly to reflect on your progress and your mindset. Are you staying focused? Are you positive? Are you focused on your growth? If you notice yourself slipping backwards into old habits or negative thinking, it's time to make some real adjustments. Just like you adjust your camera settings, just like you fine tune your focus, you have to fine, to fine tune your mindset and understand that that's an ongoing process. So the journey of transformation is not always fast, but transforming your photography career, you understand that's not just about mastering the technical aspects of the craft, but it's about fundamentally also altering your mindset. You actually have to believe that you can do this. Subconsciously, if you don't believe that you're going to be a successful person, a successful pro, you're not going to do it. You're not going to try. We don't try to do anything that subconsciously we believe isn't going to work. And nothing is more true than with your photography career. So you have to actually alter your mindset by recognizing the power of belief, by setting clear goals and taking consistent, actionable steps. You can reshape your career and achieve the type of success that you've always dreamed of. Why is my camera frozen? Give me a second here, people. There we are. I'm just trying to figure out why I'm dropping all kinds of frames. Apologize for that. Hopefully we're back. Remember, I've actually been exactly where you are. I actually have been exactly where you are. And I've faced the challenges, the setbacks, and the doubt. But I've also seen firsthand how a powerful shift in mindset can change your complete life. It's what I did. It's what took me from the lows of a failing 30-year photography career to the heights of the successes that I'm feeling right now. And I promise you, you can do the same thing. So success in photography isn't just about what you do. It's about how you think. 
keep your mindset strong and stay focused on your goals.